But why be distant with me and then get annoyed with me for for being friends with everyone else? Would you rather me just go sit in my room no, and be on my own? No, that's not what I'm saying. With Mars, it's very mixed signals right mm. now. We had a talk yesterday and I kind of said, like, look, we're both confused. If I just back off, you can have some space and some time to figure out, like, what you actually want from me. <laughs> Miles is the type of guy that wants, like, attention. Yeah, from, he needs attention. From girls, like, so he, I think... He he if he's not interested in that way, but I I'm not going to chase be. after someone that's not interested in me. I think he just wants you to go over and tickle his, um, his ego. I can't with this, this little... What? Diggle. How are you doing? Good. How are you guys doing? Yeah, good. I mean, this is not really a, a boys' night anymore. I mean, I was kind of hoping it would just be us lads. OK. <laughs> just like... I mean, it's just more because of... So you rather I didn't come? I don't know, I'm just getting, like, a bit... a bit aggravated, a bit annoyed because I'm seeing things. What do you mean, seeing things? I just see you, like, flirting with missing. Really? That, uh... I, I sort of have to interject that I don't sort of agree with that. OK. She's just being gregarious totally. and, like, friendly. I don't think she's flirting with Mitten. Like, like, Ing, Ing I feel like you can't girl. be friends with a guy find. nowadays without it being, like, misconstrued as being flirty either. Like, I have spent probably equal amounts of time with everyone. But why be distant with me and then get annoyed with me for, for being friends with everyone else? Would you rather me just go sit in my room no, and be on my own? No, that's not what I'm saying. I'm not saying that. But the thing is, we never actually went into what we wanted. We actually always said it would be... Fun, light-hearted, so I had no idea what we were going into. But I still don't know, and I don't think you know either. Mitten has then come to me as, and has said that, you know, you don't like it when whoever you're with stops giving you attention. And I said, I'm, I, give, I'm going to give you space. No, I'm going to give you no, space. No, no, I'm sorry, but this whole... You're asking advice from Mitten. I, I have... didn't ask advice. He came to okay, me and but... said this in front of Habs and Verity. OK, great. Does Mitten know me? I've hung out with him, gone to parties with him. He's not my best friend. He's never seen me in a relationship. OK, but then so you've he cannot cold have those judges. You have been like, hot and cold with me. Yeah, and I have then... been for valid reasons, Inga. You know, it, it it feels like there's been like mind games playing, like being playing, and like probably between both of us, we just need to cut the bullshit. And like before before I came here, when we were speaking, we were saying to each other like, it's like it's like high school. It's like it's like having a crush again, and it was so enjoyable. And I think being here and what we've, like, now been through, it's sort of, like, highlighted that maybe, I don't know, maybe we have more feelings involved than we thought we did. Yeah, I agree. The, obviously, the two of you are quite affected by this, and you owe it to each other to just go and, like, get back to basics. Have some fun. You deserve it. Or not. <laughs> Is everything all right? I heard you made a comment about Inga flirting with me or something. Oh, uh, yeah, everything's fine. It was just because I'd seen a few things, and then after, after that, a few people said a few things to me, and I was like, oh, okay. it slightly annoyed me. Well, I mean, firstly, I don't think she was flirting. If she was, I didn't detect it. Yeah, um, that's what I'm saying. I, I don't think, think it is from you. I think it is a bit silly to get jealous. Yeah. Like, pe people, especially if they're new to the group, are going to want to talk to other people. Yeah, no, that's you know fine. I mean? That's fine. You that's not really her, what... So she's obviously going to have to speak to someone, isn't she? Yeah. And I think because of where your head was at, you probably heightened the actual situation. I get that, but then... I think he hit the nail on the head. Yeah, maybe that is the case, but also um, she had said that you had some, some weird comment about how I am in relationships with, with dating. You know, my ego needed to be stroked and... I th yeah, I don't really know what you're like in a relationship. Yeah, to, so to that... Be from... able to be able to comment on it properly, but if you want my brutal, honest opinion, I think what's happened is you were really full on with her and then I think you were a little bit like maybe panicked by how fast it had gone, step back. She's got really confused, doesn't really understand where she stands with you. Yeah. So then maybe she's having to, like, act slightly differently. Yeah, but like... I, I get that, but then I didn't step back because I was panicking. I stepped back because she had said something very, very weird to my best friend. But again, I think that... But I think, how, how I think you you'd already, I think you'd already stepped back by No, then. no, not at all. I think it's hard because you both wanted to talk, you both wanted the other person to kind of reach out first and have this conversation. It was, to be honest, it was just a bit childish. Like, there was yeah. two people that clearly liked each other and you just needed to talk to each other. Yeah. 